a healthy breakfast in the morning is an important start for your child. It helps him focus and it can lead to improved attendance throughout the year. This morning we're learning more about new money that will be available for schools to provide free breakfast for students. Mary Calkins is live this morning to explain more about that initiative. Mary. Yes, Alex, some school districts offer students free breakfast through something known as a Community Eligibility Provision, or CEP. Now, the U.S. Department of Education uses a formula to determine which school districts qualify. And this year, 111 Charlotte-Mecklenburg schools did, which means students at those schools get free breakfast and free lunches. Now, starting this Wednesday, school districts, they can apply for a $50,000 grant to pay for programs like breakfast in the classroom or breakfast grab-and-go meals. Those schools participating in the CEP program for the first time this year will get dibs on the grants. They'll get first dibs, actually. During the pandemic, the federal government provided money for states to distribute for free meals, but that has since stopped. I think the funding would be helpful just because it would enable me to purchase some equipment that, you know, I haven't been able to. There have pl been plenty of studies that have shown that kids who eat breakfast at school um, have better attendance. Um, they do better on standardized tests um, and that they, you know, do better overall academically. Now, the total funding for this is $1.4 million. Today, I'm reaching out to districts in and around Charlotte to see if they plan to apply. Reporting live in Uptown Charlotte, Mary Calkins, WBTV, on your side.